What is up, Dokkan player? Welcome back to the channel. It is your boy, Blaze, and we are back with another Dokkan battle video. And today, before we start the video, of course, hopefully you're having a very good day today. So today, we're going to go ahead and react to the uh, LR Anniversaries, um, or the 8-year Anniversary LRs Part 2. Uh, this came out yesterday around like 10 o'clock or 12 o'clock, but your boy was already passed out. So we're going to start off this morning with the beautiful animations. Maybe we might look at the card details, but we might make it just very short and just look at the animation so here we go we're going to jump in um and we're gonna start off with i believe gohan which is pretty interesting so here we go we're going to go and jump in three two one boom oh okay this is a fire intro holy smokes all right hold on let me get this out here there we go okay Woo! I messed with the OST, okay. Uh oh Nappa, okay. Interesting. Okay. Is this Saiyan Saga? Oh okay, go on giant form, okay. Ooh! Oh, he's a unit super attack, okay. Oh, let's go, Piccolo. Was that an AoE? Okay, he's a new super with Goku. Okay. Damn, this OSC is going crazy. Oh! Let's go, Steve Fighters! Okay. Yo! That is OG. That right there is OG from the um, the opening of Dragon Ball Z. Oh my god. Never th I thought that this day I would ever see it. Let's actually watch that one more time. Here we go. Boom. This goes hard. Woo! Oh, damn. I love this. This better be on the same part as Orange Piccolo when it comes to giant form. Okay, there goes the first unit super attack. Okay, that's an AoE. And this one with Goku. Holy smokes. This is nostalgia. Alright, here we go. <laughs> Let's go. I am super duper hyped. This this screen right here with Goku. Oh, oh, that hits home, my boys. All right, that is pretty good so far. So I'm pretty excited for Goku. So this is gonna be LR Gohan, and now we're actually gonna go ahead and take a look here at the, uh, Goku. So let's actually go ahead and jump in. Let's actually make sure that we're in screen, and uh, hopefully I'm not blocked. I should be blocking, but here we go. We're going to jump in. Oh, what's playing right here? Oh, all right. Sorry about that. 
And here we go with the Goku. So here we go. Boom. Oh. Okay. Whoa. Goku looks way better. Yo. What? Oh, he nullifies! Yo! Oh my god! <laughs> what the heck? <laughs> Yo, that was beautiful. All right, there's definitely a clear winner. Uh, I definitely prefer Goku over Gohan's, but that was the animation looked way better. This is like probably the best animations in Dokkan. All right, let's, see, let's actually see that one more time. Here we go. Boom. Yo, this counter, oh my god. That's been one of the best. Woo -hoo -hoo. Oh, this guitar, oh god. Woo. The transition. Yo, that is clean, my boys. Okay, okay, okay. That was not bad at all. That was really, really good. Uh, do we have any of the translations? Translations. Uh, all right, so this is going to be for Goku, I'm assuming. Uh, Turtle School, key, category key plus three. HP attack and defense 200% across the board. Uh, 12 key super turtle school dance. Raise attack and defense for one turn. Cost, cost, damage the enemy. Uh, 18 key meter smash. Uh, raise defense, so it actually, it actually stacks the de uh, defense, which is actually pretty good. Uh, raise attack for one turn and cause mega cost of damage uh, to the enemy. Um, and then his passive, know the soul. Wait, is this? Yeah, this has to this has to be uh, Goku because uh, Gohan isn't part of Turtle School anyway, right? So um, what we have here is that uh, perform um, entrance animation upon first appearance and gain key plus four attack and defense plus 59%. And guard activate gets all attacks for six turns. Wow, okay, that's really good. Normally it's like five turns, but six turns, I would definitely take that. Um from first appearance. Key plus four attack and defense plus 159%. Survives KO damage once per turn. Oh I like that. I like that. Okay. This is actually a one of like I guess kind of the mechanics of Dokkan. Uh with the Super Saiyan Goku from of course the Planet Namic Saga. But it just came, came like a dead mechanic. So I do like the survive KO. That's actually really, really good. Um, all right. And that recovers HP by 59% once only if ending an attack turn at 40% or below. Okay, I see. Okay. Uh, gain key plus one, max of key plus five, and chance of performing critical hit plus 9%, uh, max of 59%. Oh, okay. For every attack received, gain additional defense plus 59% for the rest of battle, starting from the turn when the fifth attack has been received in battle. Uh, gain initial attack plus 120% for the rest of battle starting from the turn where the ninth attack has been received in battle. Uh, high chance to counter key blast super attacks. Uh, aim at this character and counter with tremendous power. 
Um, all right, so this is definitely gonna be here, Goku. Um, he's definitely gonna be a very good slow one character because you definitely want him to take as many hits as possible. So, wow, Goku's looking pretty broken. Um, does he have an active skill? Um, yeah, he doesn't. So the spirit bomb is gonna be his active skill. So able to use when fit, HP is 59% um, or below, or once five or more turns have elapsed from the start of battle, and there's another warrior raised on Earth category ally attacking in the same turn. Is this character actually part of the Saiyan Saga? I wonder if he's actually part of the Saiyan Saga, because so we do see here Vegeta. Um, but he does go Super Saiyan, so it's going to be pretty weird. Um, let's see here. Effect, Master Race attack temporarily and cause ultimate damage, and all attacks become critical hits during this turn activation of activation. Uh, okay, pretty good. So far, I am liking Goku. Turtle School, 200% across the board. Very, very good. Um, let's actually like this post from Goresh. Um, let's actually go ahead and take a look here. So now, uh, is my screen looking pretty good? Okay, you guys can still see. Perfect. So now his links are going to be here. Same Warrior Race, All in the Family, Experienced Fighters, In Fighter, Z Fighter, Fierce Battle, and Legendary Power. Um, and the one I really want to make sure for the categories... Uh, okay, so he's not, this is actually not part of Saiyan Saga. All right. I mean, it would have been nice because Saiyan Saga, I mean, I understand why it's not part of Saiyan Saga, but still, it would have been nice just because that category is just dead in the water. So, um, we'll see if Gohan's going to be part of that category. But this is part of the Kamehameha category, which is pretty interesting. Um, wait, does he do a Kamehameha in this one? Let me actually take a quick look here. Interesting. Okay, this, this character is part of the Kamehameha category. All right. I guess we'll take it. Uh, full power, bond of friendship, bond of parent and child. Very, very good. All right, so let's maybe try and find Gohan. All right, so this is definitely going to be here, Gohan. So bond of master and disciple, key plus three, H attack like and defense, 200% across the board. Uh, super attack effect, 12 key super, raise attack for one turn and cause colossal damage. Uh, 18 key super, Masenko, uh, raise attack and defense and cause mega colossal damage. So you're actually stacking attack and defense on your 18 key super. Okay, very, very nice. Uh, 18 key um, with the unit super attack. Uh, miraculous full time throttle ultra Z power. Okay. Uh, greatly raise attack and raise defense. And oh, okay. So now you're actually stacking attack by 50%. And then you're stacking defense by 30%. Um, and cause mega cost damage to all enemies. So it's going to be an AoE. Um, conditions for the. What is this here? Oh, activates when there's an ally whose name includes Goku, Krillin, Yamcha, or Tien attacking in the same turn. Uh, and key is 18 or more. Okay, that's for his unit super attack. And then for the unit super attack number two, uh, with Mr. Piccolo, uh, greatly raise attack and raise defense. Okay, so the same thing here uh, with the other Z fighters. Um, and that caused mega cost of damage to all enemies. So his, his 18 key super does become an AoE. Um... All right, and then it becomes the same thing here with Piccolo. All right, that's fine. Uh, and then let's actually look at his passive. So his passive is something that's going to be really interesting. So um, Smiling Ultra Z. So entrance animation activates upon first appearance and gain key plus four. Attack and defense plus 58%. Um, and perform an additional attack that has a great chance to become a super attack for six turns from first appearance. Ah. Uh, I mean, uh, sure, why not? Okay, I guess that's that's fine. I really prefer an additional super attack, like a guaranteed one. But a great chance, I guess we'll have to take it. It's still a really good chance of actually um, of that happening. So let's see what he does. I mean, he does stack attack and defense. So um, I guess I guess it'll be fine here. Um, key plus four attack and defense plus one fifty eight percent at starter turn. Uh, reduce damage received from enemies who have been hit by this character's ultra super attack or unit super by thirty percent for the turn. Oh, interesting. Okay. Ooh, that's a pretty unique uh, passive, I would say. Okay, sure. Uh, key plus one up to key plus five. Defense plus eight percent up to fifty-eight percent per attack received. Gain additional attack plus fifty-eight percent for the rest of the battle, starting from the turn when the fifth attack has been received. Perform additional super attack for the rest of the battle, starting from the turn where the eighth attack has been received. Okay, so now it makes sense why it's only a great chance to do additional super attack. Um, but it definitely seems there that Goku is definitely better defensively, is he not? Because he does have damage reduction, but only after he supers. So, I would probably say that Goku is definitely better so far, but we'll see how well he goes with the rest of his um, uh, details here. 
So now he does have an active skill. So when he actually turns into the giant ape, able to use when HP is 58% or less after, or after five or more turns have elapsed from the start of battle. And there's another bond on Master Disciple character ally attack in the same turn. So very similar to Goku, of course. And then the effect is massive rage attack temporarily and cause ultimate damage and attacks effectively against all types during the turn of activation. Okay, pretty good. Um, and then these are to be the categories. So we have your bottom master disciple, hybrid Saiyans, Goku family, youth, and we do have Saiyan Saga. Okay, beautiful. So another buff to Saiyan Saga, they definitely, definitely need it because listen, it's just dead in the water right now. Um, but he doesn't actually get the 20% leader skill, does he not? Because you have to be a pure Saiyan, so... Oh, that kind of sucks. Okay, that's fine. Um, Links, the Innocent, Saiyan Warrior Race, all in the family, Z Fighters. Gaze of Respect, Fierce Battle, and Legendary Power. Uh, I guess he actually, he actually is going to be a good looking partner with Goku because they actually share five Links together. And Goku is definitely a small one character, so... That's going to be pretty good here. So, um, yeah, very, very clean animations. Um... Definitely, I believe Goku's definitely better uh, as in terms of animations, but you guys let me know down below um, And if you guys enjoyed make sure to hit the like button sub for more videos coming down below And yeah, let me know down below which one you guys prefer um, And which one you guys prefer for the OST. I think Gohan probably was the OST But as far as animations, I think Goku is definitely better here, alright? So without saying thank you for watching and hopefully I'll see you guys on the next one Peace